Now, it really is a, a joy that in this time we also get to gather together and celebrate new life, Amalia, and welcome her into the body of Christ. Especially here this time, I think it takes on an extra delight. So, welcome. God, who is rich in mercy and love, gives us a new birth into a living hope through the sacraments of baptism. By water and the word, God delivers us from sin and death and raises us to new life in Jesus Christ. We are united with all the baptized in the one body of Christ, anointed with the gift of the Holy Spirit, and joined in God's mission for the life of the world. Kevin and Christina, do you present Analia Monroe Parker for baptism? Yes. Rebecca and Michael. Called by the Holy Spirit, trusting in the grace and love of God, do you desire to have Analia baptized into Christ? Yes. As you bring Analia to receive the gift of baptism, you are entrusted with responsibilities to live with her among God's faithful people, bring her to the Word of God and the Holy Supper, teach her the Lord's Prayer, the Creed and the Ten Commandments, Place in her hands the Holy Scriptures and nurture her in faith and prayer so that she may learn to trust God, proclaim Christ through word and deed, care for others in the world God made, and work for justice and peace. Do you promise to help Analia grow in the Christian faith and life? <laughs> Christina, do you promise to nurture Analia? in the Christian faith, as you are empowered by God's Spirit, and to help her live in the covenant of baptism and in communion with the church. People of God, all who are here, do you promise to support Analia and pray for her in her new life in Christ? Responses, we do. We do. We do. And now I would ask you all to rise as you're able as we profess our faith. I ask each of you and all of you to profess your faith in Christ Jesus, reject sin, and confess the faith of the church. Do you renounce the devil and all the forces that defy God, the powers of this world that rebel against God, and the ways of sin that draw you from God? And the response is, I renounce them. Do you believe in God the Father? I believe in God the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth. Do you believe in Jesus Christ, the Son of God? I believe in Jesus Christ, the Son of God, the Son of our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and the Holy Spirit. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life of Christ. The Lord be with you. And also with you.
and Aaliyah. I baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good job. Let us pray. We give you thanks, O oh God, that through water and the Holy Spirit, you give your daughters and sons new birth, cleanse them from sin, and raise them to eternal life. Sustain Analia with the gift of your Holy Spirit, the spirit of wisdom and understanding, the spirit of counsel and might, the spirit of knowledge and the fear of the Lord, the spirit of joy in your presence, both now and forever. Amen. 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 Analia, child of God, you have been sealed by the Holy Spirit and marked with the cross of Christ forever. Amen. <laughs> and I would invite Michael Bratz to take that candle. Light it from the fossil Jesus said, I am the light of the world. Whoever follows me will have the light of life. Let us welcome the newly baptized. We welcome you into the body of Christ and into the mission we share. Join us in giving thanks and praise to God and bearing God's creative and redeeming word to all the world. I invite you to stand to receive a blessing. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord's face shine on you. The Lord just look upon you with grace and mercy and give you peace. Amen. Amen. Go in peace. Christ is with you. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God.